Good morning, this is Tom Wittek with JustSellingHomes.ca Check out my website for more real estate related information. I'm an Ottawa real estate salesperson and I'm here to present March 2018 data. You can easily download the PDF um, of this information with even more information from my website. Uh, once I post it, it should take uh, probably today um, you can go to just selling homes go to my blog and you, you will be able to download the information okay so let's start so for for the property sold in uh, march okay so 2017 versus 2018 we had 1478 uh, houses sell in 2017 versus 1660 sold in 2018 this is march of 2018 and uh, we have an increase of uh, sales by 12.3%. Uh, Five-year average is 13.39. Inventory is still low. This is probably the fourth month that the inventory is uh, low on the Ottawa real estate market. Now, properties uh, price well are selling quicker. In March uh, 2018, the average days on the market was 43 days versus March 2017 where the average days on the market was 54 days okay now we can break this down various ways but these are the this is the gist of it okay in March um, for, for the March average prices for the residential we have 447,561 which is an increase of 8% over March 2017. In the condominium class, we have average uh, sales prices of 275,592, which is a slight increase of 0.7% versus the um, March 2017 data. This is pretty interesting. Most active price range continues to be in the 300,000 to 449,900. And there were exactly 600 sales sold March 2018. Now in the um, uh, 500,000 to 750,000, um, there, there was a staggering increase in sale and sales in March. And this, this price range, 500 to 750 represents uh, represents 21% of all uh, sales in the residential class. So the homes that sold in residential class. And there were 272 sales. Okay, so just as I mentioned uh, previous uh, month, uh, there was, you could see this spike and it's exactly, uh, you, had you have people selling houses in 300 to 449 900 price range and then most likely moving up to 500 750 uh, uh, thousand range and and i was saying this the last uh, month and now for sure you can see because of the increase there's 21 percent of all homes in that price range that sold in march for the condo uh, price point you have 175 thousand to uh, 274,999, which accounts for, so this price range, the 175 to 275, accounts for 51% of, uh, of the whole condo market. So depending where your property is or, or where you wanna buy, you can, you can kind of see where's the most uh, movement. Now, what is very interesting, and this wasn't like this last month, but uh, this month, uh, homes that sold 350,000 and up to a million and then um, one million and over have a positive um, have a positive uh, increase uh, so there, basically there were more sales uh, in march of 2018 than march 2017 within that price range so 350 and up you can see more sales uh, this march than the previous march okay and f just quick statistic about rentals uh, uh, our our board uh, members rented 551 uh, units rented in March 2018. I believe uh, last month uh, it, wa it was around 300 or so. 
Um, okay, and uh, so what else can I say? Okay, total sales volume is up by 20.6% in the residential class. So you can see it's a huge increase for March uh, 2017. You have almost 21% increase in residential class and uh, you can easily see these numbers and and more by accessing my website at justsellinghomes.ca to get the statistics for uh, march 2018 and previous months and you can get average uh, sales prices number of sales uh, for various property classes this gives you an indication whether you're selling in, uh, in in certain price point or certain class this will give you an indication of of what's selling and if you're buying in the price point or, or a specific house it will show you basically which which houses are moving quicker it's a seller's market right now and you really have to be prepared uh, to uh, to put forth uh, your best uh, best offer you we're, we're finding more and more um, multiple offer situations uh, and you really need a realtor to guide you through the process uh, also please remember that whenever the property hits uh, the market it's you there's a usually a delay of 48 hours uh, when you work with a realtor you actually get uh, uh, get the listing as uh, as soon as uh, another agent enters this information into the agent's database i appreciate you watching you can contact me at justsellinghomes.ca all the best thank you